how are you getting ready for Christmas this year? You know, one of the things I like to do is put out my nativity sets, you know, those cute ones that remind us of the story of Jesus come to earth and, and how it ends with that wonderful gift. That our Savior comes to us and this hope and all that is can be sustains us. But, you know, I wonder if we're sometimes missing the messiness of this. In a world where we want to sanitize too much, uh, uh, from our hands to our deepest struggles, I wonder if we don't want to get into this gritty, messy, struggling reality in which Jesus came into, into this world. Well, into our lives, if you will. I think sometimes we see this story as something that happened a long time ago. And, and each year, it, it, it's that as opposed to something we're participating in. Something we're living into, if you will. So I wonder if you would like to join me as we imagine this story from the foundations. From the people that encountered God entering earth. From low places and the reality of people's little ordinary lives that this is the story of a dark-skinned baby born surrounded by animal dung and dirty straw because no one would welcome his desperate family in. This is the story of a woman who's given this impossible task and a man who was pushed into uncertainty. Of people that lived or tried to live at least in the darkest of political and economic times. Of outcast shepherds and simple people who, who looked for more. I mean... That's where God enters into the world, into our lives. And when we look at these everyday stories of the gospel, we see that Jesus enters into our lives too. Not where we will hope he will be, but right where we are today. Whether that's into our fear, our anger, our grief, or, or our suffering, God shows up in this story. And we wait for God to show up again. I don't know about you, but right now, I really could use a savior. <laughs> in some ways, it's kind of like that Garth Brooks song, I Got Friends in Low Places. Well, that's where God shows up, in our low places. That's where God starts with us. As we make this journey uh, towards Christmas, this time we call Advent, I invite you to join me as we enter into this messy, confusing, hope-filled story together. I will try and post every day or two. And I invite you to walk with me on this journey, bringing only yourself and where you are right now. <laughs> May the peace of the coming Christ bring you hope, peace, joy, and love, now and always. Amen. <laughs>